or so me and my niece are in a prank war. She tied off this faucet spray her head last night and I turned the water and it got me right in the stomach. Soaked my shirt down. So she's in the shower right now and she's gonna get a nice jug of cold water over the top of her head. I just bring you along. Okay, a little something freaky, alright, that happens in my house. I don't know why, it's happened since we moved in. And there's been a couple of strange things here, and you know, we just, we write it off, and you know, there's nothing like crazy, crazy stuff going on, but um, this is one of those things, though, that I don't know why, but we're going to get to the bottom of it here in the next couple of days, hopefully. But uh, this is my little storage area underneath our um, stairs and I know you can't see what's in there but all of it really is is haunt supplies I've got my paints and my drywall compound and um, just some haunt stuff so it's pretty full and as you can see the latch latch is really easy but every night before I go to bed I make sure that this is shut and every morning when I get up, pretty much 9 out of 10 times, it's open. So I'm going to set up a camera and we're going to see why it's been opening. six o'clock in the morning and I got up and it clicked open so sorry I gotta be kind of quiet I want the babies to wake up it's pretty amazing can't wait to see what it looks like how it came open wow open again. Wow. That's crazy. My second time this week. Alright, well, not sure what's going on. I said the second time this week, so first half, you know, watch it again here just a little bit and see what happened, but we'll see what happens and I'll get back with you. Peace out.
Sunday morning, so this will be the last time I can record. Um, didn't open last night, so I don't know. It's kind of crazy, but um, I don't open up twice this week, and I got it both times, so I really don't know why it's doing it, so I guess we'll just call it a faulty latch, or maybe it's the house heating up and cooling down, I don't know, but <sighs> who knows. All right, signing off. See you later. I'm going to go back to bed. All right, so to wrap this thing up, is it a ghost? Is it a faulty latch? Is it the pressure of the stairs that makes it happen? Am I just messing with you? I, all I can tell you is that it happens. Okay, that's all I can tell you. It happens. It comes open by itself. I shut it. It's open right now. And I don't know why. I did not open it before I started video this, taping the ending of this. But it's, it's, it's open right now. I don't know why. So, we'll just leave it as a mystery. So, until later, see ya. Hello, folks. Evil Steve back to give you a different kind of rant today. I'm not going to take a lot of your time. I just got something that I got on my chest that I have to get off. Just got to get it off my chest. I'm subscribed to somebody here on YouTube. I won't mention his name. Because right now he's probably feeling like the biggest idiot in the world anyway. <laughs> 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 This guy saved a year's worth of food, a year's worth of water, and wait for it, wait for it, probably the most important thing of all, cat food, yeah, cat food, you know the stuff that you feed cats, yeah, cat food, this guy was all afraid of the coming apocalypse that was supposed to happen back in December. You heard about it? Yeah, the Mayan calendar thing. All hail the Mayans! Three cats, one can of cat food for each cat for each day for one year. Folks, get your calculators out. Holy piles of jumping cat crap. 1,095 cans. Got three cats. One can of cat food per cat for a year. 50 cases of cat food. Now if your mind works like mine works, you wonder, how much money did that guy invest in cat litter? You don't even want to think about it, do you? <laughs> Me neither. But it's been on my mind. I don't want to think about it, but I keep thinking about it. It's driving me crazy. <laughs> That's a lot of cat poop. <sighs> you know what? These are wrong. This evil Steve signing off saying... You never have enough cat food as long as you have enough cat litter. <laughs> All right, guys and girls. Um, let's get this wrapped up for the week. Um, 
I had my boy home all week last week. He was sick from Monday till Friday. Saturday and Sunday started feeling better. I sent him back to school today. But uh, with him being home and having the girls and the kids all weekend, I didn't get to the project of the week. Uh, nothing worse than somebody saying they're going to do something and they don't do it. I apologize. I'm going to really try and be better at that. Um, procrastination is uh, something I do not like to do. So I will uh, definitely try and get that going this week. Uh, I did start working on a witch jar one night uh, just because I could do it at my kitchen table and it's a three-tiered witch jar so it's got three jars all strung together and uh, it's coming along pretty good. My uh, my uh, glue gun burnt out on me so I had to go buy a new one of those. It's still in the package at home. Uh, I had to bust that out this week and get that finished up too. So nothing special. It was just, it was just an idea I had and I just wanted to try it and I got to I got some other ideas to go along with it, so we'll get that going. Uh, I just want to also let you know that on Saturday, a buddy of mine, Greg, uh, Mr. Halloween Freak, and I threw out a video. Um, it was an interview with a haunter, and I just I thought I thought of the concept that, for one, a lot of haunters out there, they 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 have all their props that they make, and they have all of their their haunts, but you never see the guy or the girl who's behind the camera. And uh, I thought it would just be interesting to start meeting some people. And Greg is one of those people. Every single video he has, he's not in them. And you don't know who he, or what he looks like or too much about him. So I just thought he'd be the perfect guy to start off with. And he's a good friend of mine. So uh, he went along with my crazy idea. But uh, that being said, if, if there's anybody out there who wants to do one, um, I would love to do it. Um, I, I got some great comments from some people and some... A couple of crappy ones too but you know what hey that's just the name of the game man some people like what you do and some people don't what do you do you know don't watch it if you don't like it so <laughs> let's uh, let's leave it at that and uh, until next week uh, keep killing it keep it real and here's a special message from my daughter Lily I'll see you next week bye they watch Bust. haunters Bust. talk Mayhem. Mayhem. On. On. Tuesday. Tuesday. Nights. Night. At. At. Eight. Eight. P.M. P.M. Eastern. Eastern. Thank you. Thank you.